Wait, use that key card I gave you to get into that room. Collect that box on the side. Hurry up, kid, we are running out of time. Shit, look, it's worse than we thought. Alright, calm down, sunshine. We've trained you for this. One step at a time. But you have only got five minutes. Wait, what happens after five minutes? You don't want to find out, kid. Shift it. Right. Power on. Clear settings. All right. Pal. All right, pal, what? We want the pal setting. And set resolution to 1920 by 1080 at 25 frames a second. Okay, yeah, I remember now. And I set the shutter speed to 50. Okay, adjusting the white balance and aperture according to my current location. Take your time with that. Get it really wrong and, uh, well, let's just say you can't fix that in post. Next, insert the card so we can store the footage. Oh, and uh, don't forget to format it. We don't want last night's shoot on there. And then plug other end of the XLR into the mixer. 48 volts. Oi, right, kid. Here comes the tricky bit. Setting up the task cap. You need to skift it now, son. Okay, okay. Menu. Set up. Quick four. Remember, the green XLR cable goes to the left, and the red cable goes to the right. You don't want to mix up channels. Sounds good to me, York. If we had time for jokes, that still would not be funny. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, right, um, setting the task cam to line, and inserting the mini jack into the tape return on the mixer, and the headphone jack into the task cam. Okay, plug these into the mixer, put them on. Okay, now to turn on sine wave. Nah, remember to turn the volume down. Turn the volume down, kid. Wait, right, adjust to minus 18 decibels and turn off sign. Quickly, you've only got a couple of seconds left. Right, I just need to press record twice to start recording and stop to save. That's everything, right? I just have to adjust the headphone wheel so the mixer and the quarter are at the same sound level. 